Hey, what's up everybody? This is Clayton Gonsalves with Go Analytics, and today I want to show you how to enter your own data in Power BI. So let's head over to my laptop and I'll show you. So I've got the Power BI desktop app open here. And uh, the way to enter your data is uh, if you're on the home tab here, you can just navigate to enter data and uh, we'll click that and this will open up uh, where we can enter our data and we can just start typing here. So let's say we're making a, uh, a shopping list and we're um, categorizing how many of each item we're getting. So let's say we're the first column here, we'll rename it uh, item and we'll create another column here called quantity. So now we have two columns and we can start any entering data here so let's say oranges and we'll tab over to get to the quantity and let's say we want a dozen uh, of oranges bananas we want uh, five bananas and uh, I'm just hitting enter to to create a new row by the way uh, let's say oatmeal one box and uh, and that's it that's how you enter your data so if uh, if you want to enter data in power bi this is all you do uh, the next step would be to uh, rename this table so that it's not just called table let's say shopping list and now we could hit edit to open the uh, power query editor and make any modifications that we want to this data or we can just hit load uh, to make it load into our data model and uh, and then we can start creating visualizations from this data as you'll see our shopping list loaded up here in our fields pane and we have item and quantity and uh, we can automatically start creating visualizations from this data um, just from uh, from from writing our own data and we can see the the totals and uh, how many of each item so that's how you enter data in Power BI. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button. And uh, to see more videos like this one, make sure to subscribe to our channel as we keep posting uh, these how-to videos uh, constantly. See you next video.